Hello and welcome to the start of a new series. We're going to be jumping into Sonic Heroes. This is a classic from back in all the way from 2003. This was uh, one of the early Sonic games in the um, whole, I guess, uh, the period of time where Sega stopped making consoles. So this is one of the, the first fully fledged Sonic adventures in. Uh, before we jump into the game, there is actually like a cool little intro opening cutscene that I think is pretty great. There's a little theme song. It's it's a fun time. Let's check it out. So there you have it, your introduction to Sonic Heroes. Uh, as the trailer was sort of uh, teasing there, we're going to be teaming up with just a million different Sonic characters. It's going to be good fun. Let's jump into the one-player mode, the story. <clears throat> we've got a selection of four different teams here. Uh, of course, we got to start with Team Sonic. This is called Sonic Heroes, not Chaotix Heroes. Long time no see. Sonic, check this out. <laughs> Guess what, Sonic Heroes? I finally developed the ultimate weapon. In three days, I'll conquer the world. Think you can stop me? <laughs> hmm. Sounds like an invitation to party. What are we gonna do, Sonic? <laughs> no worries. We've got this one. Ha! Think I'd miss this? Time to crack that Eggman wide open! Yeah, let's party! So there you have it. The foreboding threat of some sort of Eggman plot. <laughs> and, um... Here we are inside of the game. Now, the way that this game operates, you've got different formations that you can enter, and different characters will take the lead. You can restart from there when you lose a life. Each time you trigger a checkpoint, the leader's level is also increased. Okay, and like they said, we can also level up. That'll come. That'll become a little bit more uh, relevant as we go forward. But here we're. Where Knuckles, he can smash through barriers, he can take Sonic and Tails and just grab him and <laughs> throw him at people. And, uh, yeah, so he's the power character. And also, we get a little bonus if we, like, activate all the lights on the, the bumper. <laughs> there you go, a little, little five rings for us. We can also switch to Tails, which creates this little tower formation. And we can reach higher places and do uh, this attack that stuns them. It doesn't do damage. I think we have to level up Tails before it'll do damage. And Sonic, of course, runs fast. That's uh, that, as you might imagine. But 
there will be these splitting paths that you can take depending on which um, character you want to take the lead. And Knuckles can glide, or like all three of them can. Okay, Tails leveled up. So this is actually also, if you recognize the voices, the last time that they uh, had the original Sonic cast from the Sonic Adventure games, then they switched to the people who did the Sonic X TV show. So it's kind of the it was kind of the start of an era and the end of an era at the same time. Okay, let's see. Do, do I need to get up here? There's like something happening over here, but I don't know if I can get over there. The camera is not not really cooperating. Okay, it doesn't look like we can get over there. Let's check out this cannon. So we can go two different routes depending on whether we do speed or flying. Let's go flying. Alright, so now Sonic is level 3, and the first difference that you'll notice is that enemies go down a lot faster. Each enemy actually has an HP bar in this game, which I think is a cool change. It's a, a very light RPG element, and uh, now Tails is also level 3. I think he does damage now, yeah. So normally he'd only be able to stun those enemies, but since he's all the way leveled up, now he actually does damage. It's good stuff. <laughs> Now we are in some some sort of car. Sonic is the motor <laughs> powering it from the back. <laughs> That's so fun. All right, Knuckles needs to level up. You got to balance it. Make sure you pop through these little checkpoints at the right time because they do provide a free level up. Thundershoot is what they call it. <laughs> All right. Yes. Yeah, I, I remember this game. I I had been quite huge on it when it came out. I loved the aesthetic of just combining all the different Sonic characters that you've grown to love over the years. Even some deep cuts like Team Chaotix. I mean, I don't even. They're from the game called Knuckles Chaotix. But I, I have no idea what that game is. I, I, I know it exists, and I know it came out for like the Saturn or something, but nothing more. It's like a deep cut, very obscure characters, but I'm glad they got in. They've since become fan favorites of uh, certain people. My brother really likes Espio, the ninja chameleon. All right, here we go with power again. You can like split through these three different paths and collect the uh, goodies on each side of it. Okay. Press the square button while jumping in power formation to use fire dunk. Knuckle shoots us as fireballs at the Ooh. end. Ooh. Not bad. Okay, so that's something that we got because we leveled up. We also got a key. I think that plays into the special stages, so we'll we'll figure that out later. Oh, with the power, we can shoot everybody individually in different directions. So that's cool. Oh, I wish I would have gone through that with Knuckles, but oh well. I was thrust into that checkpoint. We got another one of these vehicle segments. This is kind of funny. I think I need to dodge those? Or maybe I can just blast right through them. No, yeah. <laughs> got it. 
It's kind of funny because you you think you would go through these segments with Sonic because he's the speed character, but <laughs> they usually want you to split up. Let Sonic take care of this. Yeah, Sonic's got an ability where he can blast through enemies. Okay, that didn't work so well. Oh, I lost my key. Huh? Weird. I didn't realize that getting hit. Okay. I did hear about that once. Sonic can also walk jump. <laughs> oh, and that's right, we've got our team blast. So when we see a bunch of enemies here, we can activate a special attack. Every team has their own special attack that you can use in. You get nice little bonuses usually when you use it. A couple level ups, maybe a life. But it looks like that's going to be the end of the stage. Oh, there's this guy we didn't <laughs> take care of. Let's do it. Oh gosh, <laughs> I thought I did better than that. Maybe I was taking my time too much. There's our first emblem. They bring back the emblem system. I feel like this is the real Sonic Adventure 3, but the tone of the game is very interesting in that it brings back the two-act structure of the classics. Uh, although they have different names, they're reusing all, of, all the same assets and stuff. And then they, they just brought back a less story-focused, more action-platforming version of Sonic that we've, you know, come to know over the Genesis games. They brought Sonic's color palette back to a more colorful, sort of bright blue instead of more realistic. And so it's very much uh, a return to form in that sense. At the same time, however, they still have a lot of the adventure characters and the emblem system, all that stuff, it's kind of, uh, it's interesting. It's definitely interesting the route that they took with this. All right, let's not get hit at all so that I can keep my key. <laughs> That's going to be hard. Bam. I really like the way the power characters play. Whoa. Okay, we got some dangerous little areas coming up here. And I'm not losing my key. I, I gotta keep it. I gotta figure out what it does. Whoop. Let's get Sonic in here. And then, yeah, we homing attack into the wall, which gives us the ability to wall jump. Oh, I missed the ring. We got something over here. Okay, I'm gonna miss that. <laughs> Thought I was gonna get a little more distance from that than I ended up getting. Oh yeah? Were you, do you think there was gonna be a life in there, Sonic? <laughs> Just like how Knuckles can carry these people and wear them as punching gloves. Yes, customary of uh, GameCube, PS2, and Xbox titles. <laughs> we weren't, we weren't quite as uh, advanced on the camera movement back then. Nobody really had a handle on that. It, it, 
name me any GameCube game and I will show you one with a busted camera. <laughs> Okay, we got invincibility. This turtle is swimming with a block on his back. No, Sonic, no! No! What did you do, Sonic? I was trying to pump the brakes. Man. Well, at least I got my key back. Man, Sonic needs like a brakes. The bummer that happens when you lose inside of a level is that all of your level ups disappear. So you're back to back to square one. I guess what we could do though is since we didn't take this route this time, or last time we can take it this time. When approaching a wall, use holding attack with me as leader. Press the X button while facing it to perform triangle jump. Use the left analog stick to adjust the jump angle. Bam! There we go. If we use triangle dive, we can move all around while gliding. Let's try getting items if we can. Level up! Alright. I don't imagine life is gonna still be there. Another cool thing that Sonic and Tails will do when you are in power formation is they'll automatically attack enemies when they see them. Get out of here. Okay, wait. I'm switching to Tails as soon as I get <laughs> off of this ramp. Speaking of tails, let's go the flying round, see where that takes us. Oh cool, we got another flying power up. And a team blast that we don't really need, but let's uh, crack it open anyway. Take a Sonic route. Sonic, do something about that robot shield, will you? That's right, I can create a tornado with Sonic. It'll stun enemies, do damage, and then uh, if anybody's holding a shield, their shield will blow away. Oh, I was close. I was close to getting that little collectible. Also, if you do enough damage, then the shield will eventually crumble, but it takes a while to do the damage otherwise. And then these crates, I can only bust open with Knuckles if I've got enough of a level up going on. Let's do it. I always forget to use this thing. That's right, you do, Knuckles, and we right. we would have used that if uh, if I had remembered. I want to get Knuckles to level three because it's it's pretty cool what he can do once he gets there. All knuckles, apparently. Whew! I'm glad that <laughs> that was safe, because I was just punching through there. Sonic can take us over here. Got it. 
Okay, we don't get anything for getting a second key, but... Uh, except me being proud of myself. Alright, here is our final level up. Now what Knuckles can do, before I fall off a ledge, is... Um... Oh, what is that? He can just keep punching? Anyway, there's that slam dunk that <laughs> spawns meteors. So, there's that too. Uh-oh. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Run, Sonic! It's good that they're all pretty fast. Oh, man. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Is this what we're doing? Is this, is this really what we're doing? Whew. Well, there we have it. The end of the second act. It's a long pause that they have where they just <laughs> stick that pose. <laughs> <laughs> Guess that's that. Man, I wonder what the ranking system is like. I must be doing everything totally wrong, because uh, I got all my level ups. I got a lot of rings. I feel like I, I kept a pretty good pace, but uh, apparently not. Oh, so here we, here we are in the special stage Emerald Challenge. Another kickback from the classics. All right, so we gotta keep up with the em the emerald and collect as many orbs as possible. Reminds me a lot of the Sonic 2 special stage. Oh, we've got a wide formation. Let's switch back to speed. Oh, and we can boost with the square button. Ha! Ah, what is this? All right. What is this? The, the Sonic Unleashed games and every game after? Where you just hold the boost button? Anyway, we nabbed a Chaos Emerald. That's pretty cool. And three lives. That's awesome. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. The bosses have like a, a health bar that you deplete, and you can actually see what that health bar is for the first time in like I think any Sonic game. Initiate rotary attack. Whoa. Whoa. Probably would make more sense Whoa. to fight him with Knuckles. Bam. No, oh, his name is still like etched into the screen. <laughs> that's a funny that's a funny glitch. Maybe that E is the rank I'm gonna get. <laughs> Ready for the junk pile. Okay. So we do get a better rank for doing things fast. You know, I like to keep a good schedule. What can I say? So that's gonna be the first episode of Sonic Heroes in the books. Join me next time as we continue the adventure.